morning children we have learnt how to find the lowest common multiple in this video we are going to find the highest common factor now lowest common multiple we find because multiples are unlimited so we can only find the lowest common multiple we cannot find the highest common multiple because multiples are endless but factors are finite so we will find the highest common factor in this video let's go highest common factor now children as i told you earlier also factors of a number are limited it means for every number there are few numbers in whose table that number comes for example we are going to find out the factors of 36 and 60 in this slide okay as i told you earlier we are going to find out the factors in a sequential manner starting from 1 as 1 is a factor of every number and 1 is the smallest factor of every number so factors of 36 is equal to 1 into 36 1 36 36 36 1 36 36 so 1 and the number itself will always be factors of the number okay one after one we have two now this is an even number so two is a factor of 36 two 18s are 36 so two and 18 are the factors of 36 now three three is a factor of 36 three 12s are 36 so 3 and 12 are also the factors of 36 four 9s are 36 four and 9 are the factors of 36 now we have to check the tables only between 4 and 9 so we have to check 5 6 7 and 8 only 6 in 6 tables table 36 comes 6 6 za 36 so 6 is also a factor of 36 now factors of 60 160 za 60 so 1 and 60 are the factors of 60 2 230 za 60 So two and thirty are factors of sixty. Three twenties are sixty. So three and twenty are factors of sixty. Four fifteens are sixty. So four and fifteen are factors of sixty. Five twelves are sixty or twelve fives are sixty. So five and twelve are factors of sixty. Six tens are sixty. So six and ten are factors of sixty. Now we have to check tables between six and ten. That means seven, eight, and nine. If you will recite their tables, you will come to know that sixty is not a multiple of seven, eight, or nine. So children, we have to see which are the numbers which are there in the factors of thirty-six also. and which are there in the factor factors of 60 also i have highlighted those numbers with the help of red color so one is there in both obviously because one is a factor of every number two is also there three is also there four is also there six is also there and 12 is also there so common factors of 36 and 60 are 
वन टू थ्री फोर सिक्स एंड ट्वेल्व नाउ आउट ऑफ दिस वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द हाइएस्ट कॉमन फैक्टर सो नेचुरली द बिगेस्ट नंबर is the highest common factor so 12 is the highest common factor of 36 and 60 remember children the factors of a number are finite it means they are not unlimited like th these are the only factors of 60 same way these are the only factors of 36 there is no other factor of 36 except for these numbers so factors are finite and i already told you multiples are infinite so this was how we found out highest common factor of 36 and 60 okay let us take one more example this time we have taken three numbers 26 52 and 78 and we will find out the highest common factor of these three numbers 26 126 are 26 2 13 are 26 so factors of 26 are 1 2 13 and 26 now 52 One fifty-two's are fifty-two. Fifty-two ones are fifty-two. Two twenty-six's are fifty-two. Four thirteen's are fifty-two. So the factors of fifty-two are one, two, four, thirteen, twenty-six, and fifty-two. Okay, let us find out the factors of seventy-eight. One. Seventy-eight za seventy-eight, two thirty-nine za seventy-eight, three twenty-six za seventy-eight, and six thirteen za seventy-eight. So children, one, two, three, six, thirteen, twenty-six, thirty-nine, and seventy-eight are the factors of. Seventy-eight. Okay. Again, in this slide, children, you can see some numbers have been highlighted in red. So these numbers are common to all the three factors. The they are all, the factors of all the three numbers. So common factors of twenty-six, fifty-two, and seventy-eight are one, two, and thirteen. only three common factors they have beta see only three common factors they have now highest common factor of 26 52 and 78 is 13 because 13 is the biggest among these three right so we have found out the highest common factor of three numbers also let us take one more example now we will find out highest common factor are beta this is also called hcf remember it is popularly called as hcf so we are going to find out the hcf of 28 42 and 56 now 128s are 28 214s are 28 47s are 28 so factors of 42 One forty-two za forty-two, two twenty-one za forty-two, three fourteen za forty-two, six seven za forty-two. Now, children, for finding the factors, the most important thing is knowing the tables, and not only just knowing the tables, knowing the tables very very thoroughly. then only you can find out the factors otherwise you cannot do that i am telling you now factors of 56 156 228 za 414 za 78 za 
सो वन टू फोर सेवन एट फोर्टीन ट्वेंटी एट एंड फिफ्टी सिक्स आर द फैक्टर्स ऑफ फिफ्टी सिक्स ओके नाउ चिल्ड्रन इन दीज थ्री ग्रुप्स ऑल्सो यू कैन सी सम नंबर है बाई नाउ यू हैव अंडरस्टूड वाई आई हाईलाइट द नंबर दीज आर द कॉमन फैक्टर्स ऑफ ट्वेंटी एट फोर्टी टू एंड फिफ्टी सिक्स एंड दे आर वन टू सेवन and 14 right now we have to find out hcf and hcf is 14 because 14 is the biggest number out of all these common factors so common factors highest common factor of 28 42 and 56 is 14 okay let us do this highest common factor of 45 60 and 90 now 145s are 45 315s are 45 59s are 45 so 1 3 5 9 15 and 45 are the factors of 45 okay factors of 60 1 60s are 2 30s are 60 3 20s are 60 4 15s are 60 5 12s are 60 and 6 10s are 60 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 10 12 15 20 30 60 60 are all the factors of 60 okay factors of 90 190 are 245s are 330s are 518s are 615s are and 910s are so all these numbers are the factors of 90 okay now again the red numbers are the common factors so the highlighted numbers in red color are the common factors of 45 60 and 90 and they are 1 3 5 and 15 so children in the table of 1 in the table of 3 in the table of 5 and in the table of 15 45 60 and 90 all these numbers come beta now hcf of 45 60 and 90 is 15 I really hope, children, you would have understood how to find out the highest common factor or the HCF of two or more than two numbers by listing their factors. This is listing their factors. We have made a list of their factors. See, so many factors sixty has, and we have made the list of their factors. After making the list, we will. locate the common factors and out of the common factors we will find out the highest common factor so children for finding the factors tables are most important and also divisibility tests are important so if you know these two things you can easily find the factors of any number okay children that's all for today please 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 practice this and you will become proficient i am sure that's all children thank you thank you so much and have a great day